Yeah, the vision is a faster justice delivery process in Nigeria. We've, we've run um, many states in Nigeria. If you see our our um, research booklets, it's called Ranking of State High Court. You'll see how fast justice delivery is in Nigeria. Bonu State is the first based on our 2020 ranking, and um, um, River State the last. Some states, it spans up to three, four years before justice delivery is done. Or your state has a relatively um, better ranking, but I believe with this technology, they will do better. And that is what we are doing. What we are doing today has been done in Bayosa State, which is a southeastern state. Or your state, which is a southwest state, is the prototype. They are test running in, in Oyo State. If we succeed, and I know by God's grace we will succeed, we will go around all the six Southwest states. And it will go a long way to alleviate the problems we encounter in the judiciary. If a counsel is in Lagos and wants to file process in Oyo State, he could do it immediately. He needs not to come to Ibado. He will do everything electronically. Even payment, payment of process, if we do it. From our research end to our development, end, we do a research and development angle. So we research into how fast justice delivery is in states and try to actively support them with technology to improve that ranking on our, on our, our, our research uh, documents that is available online on Gavel or even offline if it's requested. Case management plays a very important role in the administration or in trial processes. Particularly, it relates to the judge handling a case. It starts from when the case file gets to the judge, trying to monitor when it was filed, when it should be uh, ready for pre-trial conference, when pre-trial conference will be concluded and the trial process itself starts and ends. So if you can monitor, it will assist in scheduling, that is to say, giving timeliness to the cases before you. Um, first and foremost, let me appreciate Gerbel as an organization. They've been partnering with us in order to assist us in quick justice delivery system. But this time around, we also have, as part of those that are partnering with us, the, Na uh, the National Judicial Council. And uh, that's why we are very happy that um, Oyo State is one of the pilot states that they are coming to put those technology in um, place. If you do things manually, and you um, deploy technology to do it, the difference will be very, very clear. And again, electronic devices will be brought in court that will assist in so, um, some analysis of forensic uh, evidence and some other things. And that will also assist in judgment delivery timeliness. For now, the Nigeria case management system uh, is available for use by all the superior courts of record in Nigeria, from the Supreme Court, Court of Appeal, all the, the State High Court, Federal High Court, Industrial Court, all the superior courts of record in Nigeria can leverage on the Nigeria case management system. And we have a platform also for filing cases, an e-filing platform that is attached to the Nigeria case management system. Every lawyer who has a legal mail can file his uh, case 
uh, electronically to the e-filing platform and it will land into the Nigeria case management system. It will help a long way to reduce a lot of backlog of cases. If it is implemented or allowed to thrive here. Actually, we have seen the challenges we have encountered in just using the technical committee and the IT and judicial staff only in achieving this. That is why we welcome the partnership of Gavel, whom we think can help fast track the process of onboarding uh, oil state onto the uh, Nigeria case management system. We hope also that Gavel will not only stop in Borno, in, I mean in oil state, it will also help in driving the process in other states that will be willing to join the Nigeria case management system. Let me cite an example. In the FCT, as soon as you are entering the premises to the courtroom, they have digitalized everything. If you have a case in Abuja today, if you have a case in court this morning, if you are in Lagos, you're able to assess the number of cases that is coming up in each court from Abuja, from Lagos, sorry. Likewise in the battle. And on entering the premises, once you press a button to bring all the cases for that day, you know when your case is coming up. You know, if you have like three cases in a particular court, you can access the courts where they are, the number of cases they have that day or the complete docket of each court in the FCT High Court. We want it implemented in your state. If a matter is coming up next week, a cancer need not to come today like what is obtained before. When a cancer will say, oh, I lose my diary, I don't know the day my, that my case is coming up. With he finally, he will just go to bring the date. It to bring the process that he wants to do. The nobility is one aspect which is very, very important. And that is the more reason why we get most of our staffs trained for it. They'll be trained for it, then we provide the enabling environment, like um, constant supply of um, power, like uh, maintenance. And that's why our staffs too are very important. And it is going to be surely, assuredly sustained. Well, the platform is evolving. The long time thing is that we know that this will help in the dispensation of justice. There's going to be natural problems like network. And by the time we are evolving, at the beginning, what we were using is analog phone. Over the time, we started with the network we have now. Almost everybody is using Android phone now. So it is. it will evolve and get better over time. So I foresee a situation where the congestion of courts will be taken care of, where the delay in dispensation of justice will be taken care of, and at the end of the day, we'll get justice sitting from home. The judiciary aspect is the one that we have control over. So that's why we've started with the NCMS to cover all the courts in Nigeria the superior courts for a start, but with the capacity to add on the lower courts too. The e-filing is a national platform you go into and then you drill down to wherever you want to file in. Now the legal mail too is infrastructure that runs through all the applications. With that, lawyers can practice across the borders. A lawyer can sit down here in Ibarra and conduct a case, file a case, conduct it to the end, exit without leaving the burden. So the idea is to have that integrated ecosystem. And then once as a judiciary we've got it, we, our vision is to include the others in the justice sector. The ministers of justice already included partially, but only now, correctional services, the police, so that we have a situation where we can with precision detect where faults lie, apply solutions, test them. That's the vision.